Hey there everyone, welcome back to another Beef Below Boss video, and in this one we're going to be fighting Ancient Fuel Weaver. Now I did set up a catapult arena for this fight, but not for damage, but more for to counter uh, a certain phase that Ancient Fuel Weaver has. I also recommend bringing a Lazy Explorer and a Nightmare Amulet at the very least. I also advise you to bring some sanity restoring items, as being insane can be used against you in this fight. But to do this fight, you can attack Fuel Weaver three times before needing to dodge his swipe attack. He also has this bone spike attack that just summons bones and falls on you, which you can't really do anything about but dodge. Ancient Fuel Weaver also has an ability to trap multiple people in bone cages, and while the bone cage doesn't do any damage, it does trap you in place, meaning he can walk up to you and kind of just hit you for free. So I recommend teleporting out of them with the Lazy Explorer as tanking with the beefalo is not really a good idea. And yes, I did accidentally dismount there. Uh, be careful not to misclick like I did. Anyways, Ancient Fuel Weaver does have a second phase. So upon reaching 10,000 HP or lower, he can occasionally enter an invulnerable state where you can't damage him or anything can't damage him. And he starts to summon these little woven shadows that will crawl towards him and heal him if they get to him. Now this is specifically why I built the catapults for this reason as the Woven Shadows have a max HP of 1, meaning they can die pretty easily. Uh, but because there are so many, the Catapults actually have an AoE attack. So anytime they get close to Fuel Weaver, they will instantly die to the AoE from the Catapults. Now Ancient Fuel Weaver will continue to stay invulnerable until all 6 Unseen Shadow Hands are destroyed or killed. And the only way to see them is by going insane, which is why recommend you bringing the Nightmare Amulet as it is easier to control when to be insane and not be insane because he can do this multiple times. The Unseen Shadow Hands also have a max HP of 1 but because only insane players can attack them or see them the Catapults can't actually destroy them for you nor can really anything else. If you are insane there is a small chance that Ancient Fuel will try and mind control you and to tell when he's about to mind control you the shadow creatures will appear around your screen edges and to basically avoid this you can just be uninsane. So if you're wearing the nightmare amulet just take it off or if you're low naturally just restore some sanity. So like I said earlier he can enter this invulnerability state multiple times even after breaking him out of it once before. He will continue to keep his swipe attack from his first phase so just keep repeating until the fight is done. I actually don't mind this fight on a beefalo, as having a weapon in my hand is one less thing I need to worry about, so that's pretty nice. And despite seeing the Houndy Shootiest turrets here, um, it's not really needed for this fight. I just have them there as Ancient Fuel Weaver is one of those fights you can do multiple times, or you kind of have to do multiple times if you want to reset your ruins. So I just advise you to keep adding on to your arena as it'll make the fight go easier and easier as you keep repeating. And one of the things I actually found out while researching this is if you bring the Shadow Thurible with you for this fight, he actually can't do the Bone Cage attack on you. Now I just read that while researching, I'm not too sure if it's true or not because I never got around to testing it, but it is maybe something to look into if you've done this fight before. With that being said, thank you guys for watching and hope to see you in the next one.